Hi everybody, Mature Simmer here. So welcome back to my Let's Play series on a lawn mowing simulator. It's been a few minutes. Now I definitely want to keep trying to rotate content as much as I can and so been looking at things I haven't done in a bit that I had some interest in continuing and this one certainly came up. We had just finished March last time, gotten through a couple days and we're getting ready here to go into April. Obviously the goal of what I'm trying to understand in this simulator is just really ultimately what's possible, when, if do I kind of hit a wall, but you know, I've, I've got garage expansion and employee work. You know, I think I've got a good path ahead of me still. It's just been one of those I, I haven't been in for quite some time. So let's hop in and see what we've got going for us. All right, so I'm going to try to take something that's a bit more involved for my worker here so that I can go ahead and, you know, maximize the value and so forth. So if I put Eevee on this, I think it needs, yeah, just a mulcher and a collector. So, oh, a mulcher. Oh, yeah, the mulcher will be fine. I don't know what I'm talking about here. So I'm going to give her that as it doesn't much matter. And then these are very similar, so we'll confirm that contract. So she is set there. And then my real question is, do I want to do... I don't want to do a, a, the other dino one. I'm going to pass on that. I can pick up trash, which would go very, very quickly. But it's not going to give me much. Or I could go ahead and mow the rear lawn of the riding school. Although, oh, I need striping, and I don't have that. So I can't do that. This will make it easy, I suppose. So let me go pick up some trash. Yeah, that was the other thing I was worried about. It did look like it was going to be raining today. So that always makes it less fun to go ahead and mow as well. well I see a bottle there. I saw something else in there. So let's hop in. We've got... Uh, 10 minutes to find things so and again there's 12 so I'm sure some of them will be super easy although I've gotten pretty good at picking things up so frisbee there let's see oh, something else newspaper a magazine of some sort I assume they won't like they'll be on the lawn I assume they're not gonna drop things in random places a little brochure. Would somebody just have a bunch of these in their pocket and leave a trail? I don't understand. It just looks like a ball. But we've got 9 of 12 already. It's a relatively easy yard to see things in. Alright, one more. Wasn't quite as methodical as I should have been. There we go. And we'll return to the van, and it took us a whole minute and four seconds. So I'd say we're pretty efficient. I think they should give us a bonus. All right, so I got uh, 74 RP for what I did. If I go here, all right, she did the ground check, no damage. Her training, I think, is paying off, so that is good. All right, let us go and get the maintenance done on the vehicles. So I'm going to do a full repair there. So definitely a bit of, of uh, stuff going on there. All right, and then I think we're all set here. I, we shouldn't have to do... I guess there's a little bit of of things we can do, but... Alright, well, I know we're not going to be able to do much, so the only thing I potentially could do, I suppose, is see if we can train Eevee here. Alright, so she's level 2 in vehicle maintenance, but I think that will give her a lot of experience, so we're going to go ahead and do that. 
probably should have done that the day before because that's something she'll be getting. Now, can I get rid of this? Because, you know, I need the roller, but I can't, I can't do that. My goodness, all we have is Dino Safari stuff. All right, well, I'm going to give this to Eevee. This is just going to be a, a set of easy days, I suppose. So I'm going to give her that to give her some ability to move around because it looks like there's a bunch of picnic tables. Can't do the striping. Again, we'll keep leaving Dinosaur Valley, I think, for her. So yeah, we'll just see what kind of progress we can make here. All right, well, you know, you'd think after I picked up their yard yesterday, they wouldn't want to pay me again, but I suppose maybe they have a lot of kids. I mean, they do have all this play area. I was going to say things are almost in the same place, but no, they're not quite there. And we don't have the train of... Uh, of garbage laying on there. That almost looks like it's something, but it is on the table and we're more tasked with picking things up in the yard. Oh, we only have 11 things this time. I find it interesting if they know how much litter they have, why don't they just go look for it themselves? But again, it gives us money, right? 45 seconds. So we are flying through things. Maybe this will be all about getting Eevee trained. All right, we are up there. Looks like maybe we'll have leveled up. Not sure what I'm seeing there. Although, well, I don't know. But either way, not too much damage, but got things done. Weekly report, money earned paid things out, but weekly profit, we still had had a good profit. All right, so we did move up to trusted level three. We got a new challenge, which we've not done, but all right, general cut, Ripley Park, Dutchman's Lookout, that sounds promising. Litter collection, so another, another area there. So let's go look at, at Evie here. Oh, so is she maxed out? I think so. Alright, so we can give her advanced driving. We're gonna do that. Alright, well, the, oh no, the stripe job is still there. We've got crustaceous, druid tour, or that training field at Crossley. Or I could just pick up trash again. All right, let's get rid of this, so we'll just keep going. So that should work. And I'm just gonna pick up trash again. Because at this point, yeah, I do feel like I'm just, I'm just trying to get her to be the most excellent employee she can be. And then uh, we'll be able to maximize our income. Well, this is nice, all the trash is kind of together here. Actually, I guess it's only six things. That was like a little car or something. Oh, that was a stick. You have trees around your yard. I don't know that it's trash, but I get it. All right, that frisbee keeps showing up. They do get lost in the grass easily, though. I'll give it give it that. I'm getting faster every day. I know the yard pretty well now, so, you know, 44 seconds for $50. That's a pretty good hourly rate. If I could just, you know, get paid that much for mowing, that would be terrific. All right. So definitely need to repair the vehicle. All right. So we have to do our small business loan repayment. I think that's for the weekly piece there. I'm trying to remember, yep, weekly. So we've still got a bit there. We've got seven. Yeah, it just seems that we cannot do better on um, on vehicle maintenance. That's as high as we can go. So if I get her on advanced driving, so there we go. That will do that. All the striping is gone. 
Alright, looks like Crosley Field. Or no, the striping is still there. I don't know why I can't see that fifth slot. <laughs> we'll give her that one. And then, uh, let's see. So I could mow that finally. We've got the front nook. It's a little simpler. Let's go ahead and do that. Alright. Um, we'll be fine. I'm sure it's tight, but we can always get in there with things, so... Got to get to five to six centimeters. It's a little bit long. All right. So let's go get some work done. All right, five to six centimeters. We've got four minutes to do the ground check. And then in theory, 20 minutes to cut. But we already determined we don't really get any kind of bonus. So, yeah, I don't see any huge problems for the width. I think it's just a little easier to maneuver. I'll just have to be really careful. All right. Not that... I've, I've mowed this lawn before, though. So, yeah, I like getting into those little nooks, but I don't think I could have done that anyway. Oh, I didn't realize that was already four. Oh, I forgot to repair the uh, the other vehicle. All right, so let me get the cut changed. All right, there we go. We'll get that to that level. And the favorite part of this whole game all the time, the... Uh, the, uh, the deck height, or the... The camera, I should say. Alright. So, let's get our edges done. Try to not... Oh boy, I can't see again. Try to not get any flowers killed off. I think we've got to do 99 and a half. Alright. It's been so long, I'm not used to my equipment anymore, which... Makes some sense, I suppose. Just so hard to see in all cases, so. But making some decent progress here. Just not sure how fast I can go. Probably want to be careful around the edge. What am I doing here? Alright. I could have gone straight. I just, that bush scared me. Alright, so this works. But yeah, I'm guessing our deck width might be a little too wide to go out into those trellises and get into that. But we'll take a look when we get over there. Ooh, gotta be careful we can avoid flowers and all that, that that's always a good thing. See, just from this side, I can't, I can't tell if I'm fully over. I don't think I am, but if I'm not on the other side, I can't see anything. All right. I'm leaving more on the edge because somehow I sometimes feel rather than doing damage it might just be better to to come back around. Now I can definitely get in there. So I'm not sure what it's talking about with the deck width. Alright, I am leaving a lot. What was just happening there? What is it telling me? Oh, just the notification. Thought I was getting some sort of a warning. I'm like, what is happening there? Alright, let's. Well, 
let's see where we're at here again. The bushes should be more resilient, I would think. There we are. So I'm going to go straight there. Not seeing any plants nearby. Oop. Getting a little closer than I'd like. Alright, but now that's the easy part. Alright. So, one trip around, almost 15%. So, not bad. I'm probably going to go ahead, get these pieces done around the islands, and kind of get all the edging, or, or at least get my borders, so then I can go a little, little, little quicker. This is kind of the hope. So, I do like the tight turn radius here, because that should be pretty pretty good. But yeah, this is a... I don't know. Simple Sim might be underselling it a little bit. I mean, obviously, you know, it's pretty straightforward. You, you drive around, you mow a lawn, and you're, you're kind of good to go at that point. Let's see. Just trying to move a little bit quicker. This one should be simpler. I don't wanna. I don't wanna. Ah! That's what I get for rushing. So there we go. So I've destroyed a plant. I was like, oh, I can go quicker. I guess I was wrong. I can't. So they're probably gonna be upset at me. But they do seem on these English gardens to really enjoy not having any edging. Where in the U.S. you'd you'd have an edge piece, and then that would help because you kind of couldn't run in there. It just really wouldn't let you do that. So it'll be interesting how close we can get. I would think with a larger deck, it should go faster, but... Because this was kind of the, the slow period, and now we just continue with maybe a bit of the faster period. So, I don't know why I'm thinking this is a good idea, but for some reason I'm like, it's working, I'm going to go with it. Just make bigger and bigger circles. I'm doing full widths, but at least I'm not then having to break out and turn around and all that. You know, that's about as far as I can milk that, but... But yeah, we very quickly went from 25 to 35 percent with, with that. But as I always find, I think we, you know, we'll get to 97, 98 percent pretty fast, and then you kind of run into the challenge where you're then fighting to get that last little bit. Oh, I left, left a good amount there. So there's definitely a bit of a, a challenge to this in that regard. Because you kind of keep leaving little pieces here and there. But, yeah, I'm not quite sure what areas we couldn't get to with the deck, but in theory there was some, so. Alright. So get this piece done, and then we're kind of done with this part of the yard, other than the trimming. I 
I always seem so bored. I don't understand. I don't know why that always happens, but it does. I had left a little bit there again, so... Just heading back to get that more thoroughly. It's getting a little more challenging to have enough room to turn around. Goodness. Alright, well, we'll just get most of this done here. And then we'll get that last little bit. See if we get a tenth of a percent for it. Nope. Alright. Now what? Now maybe just moving along a bit. I think it was 20 minutes that it was telling me it thought it should take, so we're not quite halfway. But we're also not at 50% yet, so... But yeah, I think I'll go relatively quickly, but then the challenge continues to become uh, how, how long will it take to trim? Because, you know, I might get done with the mowing in 15 minutes, but then it'll take 30 minutes to trim. And definitely the trimming, I'm, I'm probably not going to show a lot of. That's just tedious. If people want more trimming in the videos, I guess let me know. But it doesn't seem like a super exciting thing. Not that any part of lawn mowing is super exciting. Some people might be like, this is a weird simulator, but I'll tell you. Um, it may not be that fun to watch. It might be a bit like paint drying, but it's strangely relaxing to do. I think because it just doesn't require a lot of thought. You're just, you know, hey, stay in the right low oh boy. As I say, it doesn't require a lot of thought, and I screw up the lawn. Alright, let's go back here, get that mess, because otherwise I'll forget it later. But, you know, it's just one of those kind of relatively straightforward type of things that, you know, you just got to mow the lawn and make, give them a nice lawn for them to enjoy. And it doesn't take much to do that. Just operate the machinery and give them a nice trim. That would be a weird simulator, talking about trimming. I don't know why that popped in my head. Probably because I used the word trim, but like haircutting simulator where you just sit and, and snip away at someone's head. <laughs> don't know. I'm sure if anybody did anything like that, it would be more like Salon Simulator or something. And, you know, you'd do other jobs, too. But... Alright, we have achieved 60%. Now, the challenge is, it's like every two minutes or so, I need 10% to hit that, and I'm barely keeping up with that. I'm going relatively slow, but I'm taking more than half of this grass out. You know, it's going from 13 down to 6, so I'm cutting, you know, 7 centimeters. It's not, not small. It's only 2-3 inches, but... I just don't want to overwhelm the machinery. Alright, good news is we'll be at 70 before we know it, and then that will... kind of be where we should have been at 14 minutes, and we're there at just over 13. Like I said, my hope is that I can get through some of this relatively quickly. But I am running out of longer swaths that I can just drive for a good length of time and mow. 
is at this point, like next pass, I'll basically have gotten rid of the whole segment. And then I'll have little pieces here and there left. I'm just trying not to leave things laying around. I guess I'll make sure I focus on the the right side and, and don't leave too much of that, but at this point, like, yeah, we're not going to get a huge percentage going through this segment. But I do need to remember to repair the machinery next time, because I'm sure that affects the ability to cut appropriately, too. And at this point, I think Evie's going to have done three yards without any kind of repair or maintenance. Hopefully she doesn't run the risk of running out of fuel. That would be a bit disappointing. Alright, 80%, which we should be at at 16 minutes. Oh, looks like I had a little bit there. Yes, I know I have some behind me. See, but now we're running into this piece where we're just now wasting a bunch of time going around. There was a little tuft here somewhere. I think it's right there. So that becomes part of the challenge now is now I'm doing a lot of running around without cutting anything. And so we're going to lose our efficiency for sure. I mean, there's a couple, couple long runs we can do here, but that'll be it. And then it's a lot of things. I'm wondering if I'm going to get anywhere near as far as I thought. Because honestly, only at 85%, I may barely make it to 95. That would be kind of crazy, honestly. If I had 5% left to trim, so I'd probably need to rethink my my thoughts at that point. All right, I just, just want to make sure I got this completed here. We do, and then we'll go back and do the next long one. That should get us to about 91, 92%. I figured that was going to be a bit tight and that I'd be leaving something, but... Can't always tell. All right. So good segment there. So there we go. Ninety-two, kind of as I figured. By the time we finish this hunk here, I would think I'd be at ninety-three. Once I finish and catch all that, let's make sure I don't swing too wide. Alright, 93.4. And now we're going to have this little patch. Trying to figure out the best way to do this so that, again, I'm not just driving in circles and not cutting anything as I turn around. You know, in some cases like that, you kind of need it, but if you can avoid it, it's always better. Alright, so we're at 96. And then it's just a matter of how far we can get. I don't know that we have that much left, so this is, again, a bit disconcerting. I mean, it's not a little bit, but I don't know that we're going to get to 99. It's going to be very close, that's for sure.
See, we're only at 98 and a half. Did I just hit something? It didn't look like I did. But then it looked like something folded in front of me, so I don't understand. I assumed I would have gotten some sort of error if I had. So I'll just barely make it to 99, I think. the one trellis over here. That'll probably get me another tenth of a percent. Getting a good bit of that. So let me do that. And then I can probably head over to the truck. Just straight over the patio. Oh, that actually got me to 99.2. If I can get to 99.3, that would be exceptional. No, no such luck. Alright, so... Didn't miss anything big, right? No, I don't think so. So let me go park onto my trailer. And we'll get our trimmer, or strimmer. Depending on which version you prefer to talk about. Alright. So, we're gonna... Get this. Alright. So, and I'm trying to remember. There we go. I kind of want to be able to see because I don't want to make any mistakes with the flowers if I can avoid it. We got to 99.3, but that's also probably because it was pretty close. So yeah, I thought I thought I ran pretty cleanly over here. It's the other part of the yard that I think is going to give me more uh, more bang for my buck. So let me head over to the corners here. Let's see, we're not getting a whole lot over there. But while I'm over here, I probably want to go ahead and... Alright. So that's what I figured, is that we'd have some good hunks here. I almost turned too far. I could have gotten really sloppy. How am I not getting this? Not much there. Yeesh. I cannot see anything. Again, I think it's just 99.5. There we go. So we did it. So a couple minutes longer than expected, but overall not bad. So we'll place that there. Give this a recharge, then we'll have that. So let's head out. So I had the dollar for destroying the flower but did about 300 and then yeah she did pretty well she destroyed a flower too it looks like but that's all right stuff happens all right so before i forget let me go to maintenance cuz we've probably got a good amount of repair here get the blade Refill, go back, get mine done. So, 19, that's not bad. So, much, much less wear and tear in my case. So, she's maxed out. Now we have time management. That may be it then. 
is all that she'll be able to do. So let's see what we have. Alright, all the stripe jobs left. I'm looking for Ripley's garden or whatever, but we're not getting it. Yeah, I don't know that I've done 58 Coville. The Crossley Riding Complex. Alright, so we're going to do one more set of jobs. I'm going to give her the big one this time. And then I think I'm going to... Well, that's literally the same one we did. I'm going to take this one. And that and that. So that should... Ooh, that little nook over there and all of that. This is an interesting yard. 99 and a half. Wow, yeah. This is this is a tight one. It said it was easy, but I'm not sure I agree with that. Cause yeah, like getting back here and like I don't think I can go in there with the lawnmower and you're behind the the flowers. There we go. Nope, one more. All right. Yeah, we're not doing the front. Forgot I need to set the throttle on this. Otherwise it doesn't really move. Alright, so we're going to engage the cutting blade. Alright, so let's do the best we can here. But again, the challenge is like the, you know, you don't want to hit the brick, you don't want to, because then you start doing damage to other things, you know, it, it gives you penalties. So yeah, there's a, there's a bit here, it's not very big. Like, you can see the percent moves very quickly, but mm, there's just a lot. So, I'm going to have to be... Yeah, like, I can't even get behind these. Like, that has to all be cut with the trimmer. So, I don't know. I'm just... I guess I'll do the most that I can with this and then we'll just deal with the trimmer for a good part of this yard because this is this is tricky this is uh more than i would think i'm assuming that's a swimming pool of some sort but i mean it does have like railing or whatever it's just it's interesting again very different than what i'd look at in the states um, because that almost, to me, would resemble more of a hot tub, um, than anything else, so that's my confusion there. I just don't want to get too close to the flowers. Alright, so get in there. And get ourselves around. I want to get to the point where I can you know, maybe move through a few swaths here with some speed, but it's proving a bit challenging, I'll tell you that. Question is, can I get through here? Yeah, I suppose I can, so that'll help, because that'll get a good hunk of this taken care of. Ooh. Gotta be careful. Definitely don't want to run things over if I can avoid it. Oh boy. It's the best way out of here. Alright. That'll work. Alright, 
34. I mean, in theory, it's only supposed to be like, you know, 10 minutes or something. I didn't really look at the length of this. It almost seems like it's a little bit longer, like it's like 15 centimeters or something. Just not sure. All right, 50 percent. But yeah, we're definitely going to wrap this episode up after this. I think that'll be more than enough. I don't want to make it too terribly long, but we've definitely also stuck with the work uh, a lot more than I normally do. I think, you know, I would have been like, all right, I'm going to go mow and we'll rejoin when I'm done. Seems like I'm leaving a bunch there. I don't understand what is happening there either. So, let me like go back over these, but... Maybe it just looks that way. Or am I am I damaging the the lawn? That would be disappointing if that was what was happening. Alright, does this get me to seventy? Not quite yet. Let's get that piece removed. Yeah, we're going to get most of this done, and we're going to have a ton left yet. I don't like how the wheels aren't turning. I don't know if they're really doing that, because that would seem to be just jacking up the lawn pretty badly. I mean, I'm not getting any of the screaming and yelling that you normally do, but I mean, I'm barely going to hit 80% with this. This is crazy. Because I'm pretty much done with what I can mow. I mean, obviously I've got this little bit here, but if I hit 85, I'm going to be amazed. 83, there you go. So. Unless I missed something, um, I'm going to go get this back on the trailer, I guess. Pick up the deck so I don't do any damage there. Oh, I need, still need the throttle up, I guess, to get in there. Now we can do that. All right, so let's grab this trimmer and let's head on over. understand why it's not trimming as quickly as I would think. I mean, I have it down, I think, but yet yeah, it's not. Oh, I think I just, yep, I did. Darn it. How is that? Wow. Right. Well, the bike shouldn't much matter, so I should be able to get in there pretty thoroughly. Yeah, 
Ooh. I'm gonna end up really causing some issues if I'm not careful. Alright, let's go do all this. And again, there's a lot of flowers. I'm not liking that part, I'll tell you that. Because again, if I can do this part, I can get kind of near the box. But let me, me kind of do that segment. This is not nearly as much as I thought. Like, I thought coming back here I'd get four or five percentage points, and I'm really not. That's crazy. I'm getting a little lost as to what to finish here. All right, I guess, yeah, we have some by the brick, which is good, because, you know, this at least is just edging then. Oh, there's flowers there, so... Do, whoa! I don't know how I got that close, but I did. Alright, so we've got some of this here. Yeah, because the problem ends up... Like, you're almost... I don't know. Like, what am I missing? I don't have large swaths here. Alright, I suppose I've got the piece over here. Again, I'm getting like a tenth of a percent. I mean, this is not not a lot. Oh yeah, yay. Alright, well, let me keep working at this, because at this point this has got to be getting pretty dull, but... Like, I feel like I'm missing some giant section of yard. Like, I don't understand how it could be that complicated. Alright, well, this helps. I did not realize this entire front yard is, is actually supposed to be mowed. So, there's not really a way to get here other than do this, so... But that makes me feel a bit, uh, well, a lot better, because I'm like... I'm running out of lawn, and I just was not seeing it, but yeah, this is a, this is now moving along kind of nicely, so let's see. This might finish up pretty quickly. Of course, I say that, and I'm probably going to have to go look for swaths of grass or something. Well, we're up to 99, though, so maybe not. You know, the nice thing is I can go really fast here. Alright, I think I need 99 and a half. There we go. Oh my goodness. Okay, well if I knew that, I would have been a lot faster. Alright, I think I took out like four or five plants though, so... Yeah, four and then collisions. So not great. Not quite there yet. Alright, let's go do our maintenance. So, that was... That was me, but this is the one she used, which always seems to do way more damage and cost way more, and I guess that's the downside, is like... You know, they're doing work. But she, I think, is fully... Oh no, she's not fully trained yet. I don't know if it'll remember that, because I'm not going to go forward today. But yeah, we are here, and... You know, our net worth went up a little bit, our funds went up a tiny bit, but, you know, we worked a good set of days here. Now, once again, I didn't mow lawns much this week to get things through, and we did honestly spend a good amount on training Eevee, so 
maybe that was the issue but hopefully again a little bit of fun uh, getting back into this after a, a, a several months hiatus uh, let me know what you think let me know if you've you're enjoying it if you are and you haven't dropped a like please consider that and if you are not a subscriber to the channel please consider that and I will see you next time <laughs>